My name is Nikki Winter and I'm the site engineer here on the Waimakariri Bridge Widening Project. So the Waimakariri Bridge is actually two bridges. We've got a northbound bridge which has two lanes and we have a southbound bridge which has two lanes. Each of those bridges is going to get a new lane. So we'll have three lanes southbound and three lanes northbound. The old bridge was built in the late 60s and it was built with concrete pier heads that were wide enough to accommodate extra lanes through the middle of the two bridges. It did need extra strengthening because um, the concrete doesn't meet current codes so we have had to add extra steel in but it was built wide enough to accommodate the new lanes. On the downstream side of the southbound bridge there's going to be a shared user path for cyclists and pedestrians. That will mean that we can have all modes of transport really across the bridge. You'll have the vehicles on the new lanes and you'll also be able to have cyclists and pedestrians on the shared user path. There are a number of activities where we need to close one bridge at a time, whether it's the southbound or the northbound bridge. So what we do in that case is we contraflow traffic onto the bridge that's still open, which means we have one lane of traffic in each direction on the open bridge while we're working on the closed bridge. We'll do that if we need to lift beams over the bridge or if we need to pour concrete on the new lanes for the bridge. If the river floods, we often need to reclaim the beach that we've lost uh, for access to the, the bridge piers. In advance of a flood, we are monitoring the river every day. We monitor the weather and we also monitor the rainfall up country of us. And we would clear all our gear out of the riverbed if we know that there's going to be a flood coming through. So we would move all our um, machinery to higher ground. If we know it's going to be a big flood, we'll move everything out um, beyond the stop banks. The thing I like most about my job is the variety and the team that I get to work with. We've got a really experienced group of people here with um, different areas of knowledge and it's been awesome to get to learn a bit from each one of them and to see their expertise in action here on the bridge. So this is my last week as a site engineer and I'll be off on maternity leave after that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>